keep you in a busy day. Brother Kai broke down and he had to go and handle that situation. But we're still on time for work, even though they're talking about some type of tornado and storm from Oklahoma is supposed to hit and all that good stuff. We still show up for work around here, baby. This right here, this is work. When I'm working on this job, I still show up. And then I go work with Mr. Charlie. So, yeah, and then after Mr. Charlie, I go work on something else. Because we steady trying to improve. Now, did a video yesterday telling all y'all truck drivers how y'all can set up a Roth IRA account. Now, I didn't think anybody was going to listen to me. But two people did. Two people. I got your names. Joseph and Gerard. That's two different people. Gerard and Joseph. Both of them went, clicked the link. They clicked the link in that description box. They signed up for Robin Hood. They got their five free dollars. If you want to sign up too, Robin Hood will give you, they'll give you up to $200. But more than likely, 99% of people just get $5. Take that $5 and get whatever stock you want with it. Now, they got $5. I received $5 also because they signed up. So we and we are for both of us. I took my $5. I got Amazon, more Amazon stock. I split it between Amazon and Tesla. $5 on Amazon, $5 on Tesla. They got a brokerage account with $5 to start off with. And like I said, they can open up their RA right there on Robinhood and start getting those good ETFs. Speaking of ETFs, I put a little bit in my ETF account today. I bought VGT while I was down on the Roth IRA side. That's the only thing I did on the Roth side. And then as far as my regular brokerage, just Amazon and Tesla. And one of you guys just commented and asked me, Hey, Andrew, ain't your stocks down on Tesla? Tesla is down today, the whole market down today, which is why I bought today, baby. See, just because the market is down, yes, we losing money. It's a good opportunity to buy because market down today, market could be up tomorrow. But what I don't do is sell out and take a loss. I don't take no losses no more when it comes to stocks. You only take a loss when you got all your money in the stock market, you out there leasing a the truck, you don't know if the check coming Friday and you get in the situation where you all of a sudden need money, now you got to sell stocks at a loss and transfer it to your bank account and spend that money and if you operating like that, that's exactly what's going to happen because I've been there and done that. Done that all 2020, being stupid. That was back when I was options trading though. So when you gambling High states gambling, baby. By the way, speaking of high states gambling, we got an update from Fuck You Money. The man came on live. You know, he said uh, he's still doing penny stocks, or uh, I, I'm assuming it's penny stocks, but he, he said he lost $30,000. That's the update from Fuck You Money. Now, he's supposed to show up to Nashville sometime or this week or next week. And uh, we're going to hang out when he get here. So, I don't know when that is. He got my phone number, though. Just whenever he got to load through here, we'll have a video for y'all. Now, like I said, if you guys want to sign up for a Raw RA account or just a brokerage account, link down below. You get $5. I get $5. It's a win-win, right? I don't, it's better than me asking you for cash up or donations. See, I'm only going to promote something that's beneficial for you. It's beneficial for you, beneficial for me. Now, me and Josh, my favorite lease driver, we got into a little argument yesterday in the comment section. Some of y'all might have seen it. One of you subscribers has said, Hey, Andrew, did you see Josh's paycheck? Okay. I had to go find it. I thought Josh did a video on it. I seen it was a community post. It was $2,000. Guess y'all try and let me know that the leasing is worth it. Josh said $2,000. That's better than nothing. Now, Josh, some of these people don't understand that me and you been going back and forth about this since 2016. We got a long history of, you know, you trying to prove that this leasing thing is just working and 
whole time you've been proved that I didn't bought three trucks, a trailer, ran a whole business, and but you're still trying, still trying. Now, I know how Josh operate, so right off the top, when I seen the two thousand dollars, I'm first thing I'm thinking, where's the rest of the check? Because one thing I know about Josh. You can you can't believe nothing he says. You have to see the entire check. And I'm explaining to you why you gotta see the entire check before he deleted. And the judge probably gonna delete it. But let's just take a look at the small little amount, the little is little bit of check that he did show. I want you to notice something on the check, the dates. Let's look at the dates. March fourth through March twenty second. That's over seven days right there. We don't know why he got a date. Is one date on there. Uh, March 4th, March 9th, March 13th. And it goes all the way up to March 22nd. I'm confused. Why, why is there so many dates on this check? Josh? That's why I asked you. I said, Josh, man, send, email me the whole check. See, I don't I don't care what carry you work for. Plus, you already put it out. You're over at... Omega, some some one of them companies. I don't, I don't care nothing about that. I just want to see the whole check so I can read it because you trying to convince me that the check is $2,000. I think otherwise, Josh. I think otherwise because you've been trying to get your own fuel car. You said you got some fuel cars. So, Josh, if you're using any of those fuel cars, that would mean... Josh, you know where I'm going with this because we've been doing this since 2016, Josh. See, the crowd don't know. But you know I know, Josh. Now, Josh, did you, out of that $2,000 check that you got, how much of that do we got to deduct to pay off the fuel card, Josh? How much How much fuel did you use on your own fuel card so we can lower that $2,000? Because I don't like fooling the people, Josh. You love fooling the people, trying to make it seem like something it ain't. And the people, even though, you know, it be right there in their face, but because they don't know, that's why they get sucked into leasing, because they just don't know. But somebody like me who's advanced and been at this crap for a long time, uh, seeing people like you all the time, you know, and you ain't never fooled me, Josh, just send the whole check. So I, I do a whole review on it, and if it's $2,000, we'll give it to you. Now, I, I gave you my email, and Josh, it's 24 hours that went by, you still ain't sent the settlement. So I'm confused why you can't send the settlement. We know what carrier you're working, so I mean, what you got to block something out? We'll block it out and send it to him, but don't block out the important stuff, you know. See, Josh, no, see, that's why Josh hate me so much. Josh, tell, Josh, tell him, do a video, tell everybody how much you hate me because uh, you keep lying to the people and I keep correcting you, Josh. Why are you fooling the people for? Fooling the people like that for, Josh? Now, Josh, you, you OTR or something like that, ain't you, Josh? I'm going to do some quick math for you, okay? Mr. Charlie, if I work five days a week, work 60 hours, uh, Josh, Mr. Charlie, give me $2,000 too. So I'd rather just do, do, do the home every day, Josh. I'd be home every day. Two days off a week. Full benefits, 401k for my $2,000, Josh. Mr. Charlie pays me for all of my time. That's what I'd rather do for two thousand dollars, Josh. I don't want to go from one side of planet to the. Oh, you tired of you tired of letting people know that's what you. Okay, Josh, I, you're doing a short hop. So I forgot. I, I forgot all these leasing guys. They do this. Uh, this all of a sudden, everybody's doing this auto part shit with with these. If y'all ain't heard, it don't really matter which lease drive you click on. It's all auto parts at this point. So now y'all y'all all doing auto parts. So now it's short hop, Josh. So. Short, you don't go that far. They got their own dedicated customers, four, five dollars a mile. Josh. I hear what you're saying. I, I hear what you're saying, Josh. That's something new. That's something new. Everybody doing auto parts. Huh, something new. What? Hmm, interesting. Funny how that works out, but man, that was a short video, huh? I didn't cover everything. That man that came on here to congratulate the two people, Joseph and Gerard, on making their brokerage account. Now, the rest of y'all need to. Click that link down in the description box. Sign up too. The person I actually did the video for, he didn't sign up yet. Oh, come on, brother. Somebody send the video so we can get him signed up too now. We need everybody winning. You doing it, Josh? You too. Click that link, baby. Beneficial for everybody. 
like I said, I'm just asking you to put five dollars into your Roth IRA to get started. Take one dollar, buy ETF. Five ETFs, one dollar each. And that way, when you spend your dollar on your ETF, you get to see how the prices fluctuate. Today is down, tomorrow is up, next week down, and next week out there it is up. But over time, you should see your $5 growing. And then you'll say, hmm, man, what if I were to put $100 in, or 1000 or 20% of my paycheck over time? Oh, see? Now you're going somewhere. Now, I'm tell you what I'm doing, though. <laughs> when Mr. Charlie started running these checks to me, you guessed it. The whole damn thing. Majority of it is in the stock market. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Now, a lot of y'all still trying to figure out uh, which uh, company I'm going to. Uh, y'all all over the place at this point. Majority of y'all was saying I'm a love driver. I'm seeing some guys saying pilot. Uh, it was a new company y'all had named, uh, somebody said J J L P or something like that. I don't know who that is, but, hey, you know, like I said, if you guys want any of them jobs, apply for it, baby. Y'all be talking, it's like, Andrew, you gatekeeping. What's, what's, what's the gatekeeping? Go apply. If you want to be home every day, go on Craigslist. See, it always, it always go back to Craigslist, and indeed. Type in your home city. Type in local truck driving jobs. See who's hiring that can get you home. You know fuel hauls is home every day, so you just need to know what fuel hauler companies is around in your area, baby. And apply before everybody else apply and then it ain't. Look, I'm, I'm going to give you. Look, see, look. I gave you Cisco. I done gave you McLean. Now I'm going to give you uh, one that don't pay so good. It's low pay, but they'll probably let you in, though. If I can remember the name, I believe it's called Eagle. It's Eagle something. Eagle Corporation Transport Petroleum. Eagle is some Eagle man. Eagle Petroleum or I can't remember. You know, Google all them names I just named. What do y'all get in the comment section and correct me? They pay you about a thousand a week, but get, hey, they gonna have you home every day. It is low pay, full benefits, all the shoe shine. I don't know what all states they hire in, but this is for the new people that's new to fuel hauling. And, and like I said, just go on their website when you find it. It'll show you all the states they hire in. Now I gave you the lowest paying, okay? I gave you the lowest paying. I gave you Cisco and McLean. Y'all want to see all them drivers pay checks that work at Cisco and McLean? They on YouTube, too. Them Cisco drivers be posting their check. Hey, look at me. I'm $2,000 over here at Cisco at home every day. I be seeing them, too. I, I be seeing them, too. Salute to those drivers. But like I said, I'm just on here reporting. Uh, letting y'all know about that link in the description box, baby. Yeah, because I done found a new way to help drivers out while creating income for myself. See, extra income. Win, win for everybody. You winning, I'm winning. We helping each other out. Now, Josh, now, if you want to send that settlement, like I said, Josh, I done sent you my email. If you ain't got it, comment down below. I'll resend it to you. But, Josh, with these dates that you got on this settlement, and everybody finna see it, if you don't go delete it, uh, Josh, you got some explaining to do. Why, why is the check from March 4th all the way up to... March 22nd, Josh, that's more than seven. Are you bi-weekly? Did you make $2,000 bi-weekly? Is that what, Josh, you got a lot of explaining to do, Josh. I, don't, I just don't understand, Josh. Why even post a check at all if you ain't gonna put, Josh, 